Team, welcome to Kesteva Office Hours. You are now out of the auditorium. A bunch of you have requested to see what my setup is like, so that's exactly what we're doing today. But I'm gonna be walking through some of the big things that I enjoy to have in my space as I work. Most of the time, everything that I have around me is hopefully curated to help me perform better, both in my studies, in my professional career, as well as me trying to generate and create content for all of you. So come on. Let's check it out. Behind me, we have my little makeshift library. It contains all the essentials for the structural engineer. Something you'll notice in my library is that I don't just have codes and provisions, but I also carry textbooks like my design of wood structures. This thing has helped me out tremendously over the years, so don't doubt the information that's contained in school textbooks as opposed to just codes. And then we got our island of misfit products uh, that I've accumulated over the years and found a cozy spot in my closet. I don't go in here too much. Over at the desk, we've got two Dell 24-inch monitors. What's crazy is that these in pre-pandemic I picked up for about 100 bucks a piece, and now they're going for about 250 each on Amazon. Dual monitor setup is something pretty typical for a structural engineer. You need a lot of screen real estate to keep you productive and keep you moving. And let's not forget, I always got a cup of coffee or tea to keep me sharp throughout the day. At this beautiful Logitech keyboard in front of me is where I craft all my poorly written emails to contractors. And right beside that, my Microsoft mouse that I think was made before actual home computers were made. Uh, the total value of, I think, combined, $1. Underneath my desk, I've mounted my work laptop with a couple of screws and bolts that I've picked up from Home Depot. It's a little bit barbaric, but it works out great for me. And right next door is my tower. This is where I create all of my YouTube content as well as anything else that I'm working on. The main point of mounting everything underneath my desk is to keep my space open and clear for reading drawings and crunching through hand calcs. One last way I've tried to declutter is by mounting a power strip to the underside of my desk as well as installing a cable tray that collects all of my miscellaneous cords because there's a ton of them. Back up top, we've got Elsa and friends holding down the fort. One of my workplace essentials are my Microsoft headphones. While they haven't held up the best over the years, to me the sound quality is unmatched as well as the noise canceling. All of the adjustability is right there on the headset and there's no wires getting in my way, tangling me up and causing problems. Front and center, I always have my TI-36X Pro calculator to help me get through my days. I don't think there's a single structural engineer out there that doesn't have a calculator somewhere on their desk. And the best part about this puppy, it's bulletproof. See? The only thing I use to write anymore are these friction erasable pens. As soon as you start using one of these, you won't go back to anything else. And I just want to be clear that I don't get sponsored by any of these things that I'm showing you here today. They're just stuff that I truly love to use on my day to day. I spend most of my day sitting in this chair that I picked up from a tag sale. Definitely not the best, but if you look closely here, you can see it does have the built-in lumbar support, which I really, really love, which keeps me excited to come back and sit in it day after day after day for an eternity. But in come the amazing people from Easy Ergo. They were generous enough to hook me up with a brand new desk chair. Easy Ergo is one of the few companies in this space that's actually providing a cost-effective solution for the little guys like me. And trust me when I say that they haven't sacrificed on comfort one bit. The chair was delivered directly to my door in a nice, neat little package. Easy instructions to follow, all tools included. And I'm not gonna lie, I had a little fun while I was doing it. I ended up going with the Apollo Ergonomic Office Chair in ash gray. It comes with six adjustability features, including a movable lumbar support, an amazingly comfortable yet firm cushion to keep you comfortable yet provide long-lasting support all throughout the day. And the mesh backing doesn't just look cool, it keeps me cool throughout the day as well. I've always been a big proponent of both standing and sitting throughout my workday. So to meet this goal, I decided to invest in a pair of sit-stand legs from Vivo. With this setup, I can easily switch from sitting to standing and back anytime throughout the day, keeping my legs fresh and keeping my mind focused. And the best part, it only takes a click of a button. I don't think I'll ever go back to a standard desk again. It's been quite the journey so far, transforming this little room into a home office. And apparently if you look at everybody else's home setup on YouTube, I clearly have a long, long way to go. One thing I am curious on, 
Do you prefer to sit or stand to get your work done? Let me know in the comments down below. And until next time, this is Rich with Team Kesteva. Thanks for stopping by the office, and I'll see everybody next time. Later.